Hello and thanks for joining MTurk Guide. Today I want to discuss Google Requester and I'm not actually going to show you a lot on the screen today and that's because um, of what happens when you either allow a hit from a Google Requester to either expire or you actively return it. Um, so Google Requesters are uh, the infamous Zoltar, um, Will, as you can see, is one requester. YouTube Artist is another one. Uh, Mountains, which is very, which are very popular hits. Uh, uh, Virals or Viral M Turk, also very popular. Um, Sergi Schmid is also a Google requester. And the background behind it, as far as I can tell, is that you know they don't want you working uh, out of a queue. What, you know, in your hits assigned to you, they really would prefer if you did one, finished it, you know, moved on to the next, accepted the next one in sort of that linear fashion, rather than hoarding um, twenty five into your queue and then working through your queue. Um, and we know that, or hopefully, you know that things like Chark Master and Panda Crazy can help you fill up your queue while you're working on other things to maximize your, your time and efficiency. If you don't know what Panda Crazy and Chark Master is, or if the words queue and hits assigned and all that is not resonating with you, then um, take a look at the other webcasts that I have put up uh, or shoot me a message on the Facebook page or a comment here and I can point you in the right direction to make sure that you're um, you you have everything you need to make sure that you understand what I'm what I'm talking about and, and what I'm showing you. So, essentially, the Google requester again is is they're trying they they sort of frown upon the hoarding. And so, what happens is is if you have uh, too many in your queue, and if they happen to be a short timer, which isn't the case with this one, but if you happen to have one that's a short timer, like I'll take YouTube artist for example, believe it's a seven minute timer. So if you get in over your head a little bit and you get stuck on one or um, you get distracted in some way, which happens a lot, at least in my household with the kids running around, um, then you know you risk having one expire. Um, or if you come across one that you, you know, you're having trouble answering and you opt to return it, you know, same thing would occur. So um, what has happened in this case is that I actually did let uh, one of the wills I was working on expire. Um, and this is what will happen when you try to move on to another Google requester. And to be very, very clear here, just because you let a Google requester hit expire or you return it does not mean you're locked out of MTurk. It's not the end of the world. It is simply that you will be locked out of other Google requester hits, including the one of the type you are working on for the duration of the hit that you let expire. Okay. So this one um, that I allowed to expire is uh, three hours and 20 minutes. So I will be locked out of Google requesters for three hours and 20 minutes. So in the next, um, as soon as this expires, the next three hours and 20 minutes, if um, Zoltar were to pop back up, which wouldn't usually doesn't happen, but let's say, you know, if Mountain were to pop up or YouTube artist, I would be locked out. And what I would get is this, an error occurred, please refresh the current page in your browser. And that's what I would see over and over again, just like I'm seeing it now. Now, when you get this, if you are, know that you returned or something expired, then you know what the root cause of this is. And really, you just got to go move on and do some stuff that's not Google requester related um, until you're sort of out of a Google requester jail, if you will, if that's what we will call it, I guess. Um, so if you know the root cause and you know why it occurred, then, then that's why you're seeing that and you need to go move on to something else. Now, if let's say, let's hypothetically say that you hop on in the morning and you've got Turk Master or Panda Crazy going and you fill up your queue with Wills or Zoltar or whatever, it's Google Requester. You go to do the first one and you're getting this error. Now, you know, because you just logged on for the day, then you didn't tur you weren't turking for the last, you know, 10 hours or whatever, that there's just simply no way that you could have returned or, or had something expire in your queue. You just got online. Um, so in that particular case, what you would do is you would go up to your hits assigned to you and you would go through each one. 
click on it, you know, bring up this page that you see here in front of in front of you um, and click through each one and see if you can get one in your queue to work, uh, meaning that you get the usual you know, work in front of you, not this blinking error. Um, you have to go through all, you know, if you have 25 in queue or how many you have in your queue, um, you go through them all and find the one that works. And generally that will get you out of that, that jail. And then once you get, um, once you get the first one done, usually you can go back up to the top of your queue and you can uh, go ahead and work as you normally would work. Uh, so, you know, that's something to try if, if you, you know, happen to find yourself in that situation. Uh, typically you, uh, I believe I have a script running now that actually is forcing the refresh um, for me, um, but I think normally you would see this and um, you would have to manually refresh if you're not running any script. So if you see this and it's not blinking like this, then you would go ahead and you could right click um, refresh within the frame um, or refresh at the top of the page. I prefer to refresh in the frame because I, I refreshing at the top of the page in a Google requester makes me nervous sometimes because they just they behave differently, obviously, than other hits in MTurk. They've got their own little set of sub rules, and I think it just makes me a little nervous about about um, handling them in specific ways. So. Um, if I had a will that I could do for you, I would show you what a will is all about. But um, just in, in quick summary, uh, and I'll do a webcast of one as soon as I get one that um, <laughs> isn't errored. Uh, but will is a Google requester. Um, you look at, I think it's 20 clips of videos and you tell, um, you indicate whether a specific action is, is in that video. So it might be... Um, is there a human crawling in this video? And then there's a baby crawling. You would say yes. Um, there's some sub rules in there, uh, all of which I'll I'll detail in the webcast if I'm able to do that um, in the next day or so. So, but um, wills, you know, again, it's as it says, it's five. I'd say five to eight minutes of work per forty cents a hit. Typically, you can grab ten out of every batch. Occasionally, I think this morning they let you get twenty out of a batch. Um, but typically it's 10. You can go ahead and load up your, your queue with 10 of them. Um, and, uh, you know, again, Google requester. So just, you know, get them, do them and get them off your plate. But if you, um, if they're around and you can grab your 10, it's a quick, easy, um, you know, f uh, $4 for the day. Um, it's a nice little, nice little ad for, you know, you know you're talking about probably in the end, you're, you're, you're at about, you know, 45 minutes or so, um, probably less as you get into it. Um, I say five to eight minutes on a conservative note to not, you know, deter people because they actually are really good hits and you can, you can fly through them because um, the clips are only, you know, 10 seconds a piece. So they're not that bad, really. Um, in terms of the, the amount of time. And as you can see from the qualifications, you need to have at least one uh, approved hit, which, you know, if you've done anything in MTurk, you'll have one approved hit. Your approval rating is not less than 90%. And, you know, frankly, you know, you, you need to be somewhere in 99 to 100 to be getting the best of the best hits uh, accessible to you. And your location is the United States, which is very typical of the Google requesters and asking that the people who do the hits are located in the United States. So that's a quick um, discussion and visual representation of Google requester, uh, specifically Will. So um, as time goes on and I get more uh, various hits in my queue, I will be launching up the webcast and I will be recording it. So as usual, if you have questions, post a comment below, uh, come on over to the Facebook page and uh, ask a question there. Uh, also feel free to leave comments. Let me know if you uh, want other videos done or if you don't understand how to use a specific tool. I, in the near future, will be doing Turkmaster Panda Crazy uh, Hit Scraper and then uh, just a whole uh, set of some of the typical hits that I do on a day to day basis that, you know, aren't survey based. Obviously, I can't do anything that's survey based because um, I would be sharing survey content, which is a big no, no. So um, essentially anything that's batch 
badge type work is is what I can share on a screencast with you. But I, I can certainly help with any questions on generalities around surveys of how they operate um, or if you're running into any technical issues with surveys. So again, you know, ask away. I'm here to help. I would like to see that people be successful with this because there is a lot of potential there. Um, I think the um, today is Saturday, um, September 3rd. Uh, for those that are listening to this at a different time. Um, and the uh, weekly reports come out on Sunday. So we'll, we'll kind of know how the week was looking. I think um, for the time I put in this week, which wasn't a lot because of other things going on, I think I'm going to be around 200 for the week. So again, it's, you know, it's not huge, but it's enough money to allow me to put into other um, activities, which do generate more income. So, all right, please like, uh, comment, like, subscribe, say hi, uh, and let me know your thoughts. I appreciate uh, you joining. Thank you.